watching Alpha Yoda. He's got a phone call that you need to put some air in your tires. So. Um, I don't know. I was actually going to have to get a new tire. But, you know, I think fucking... That's messed up, man. That damn car on the road. I was I'm recording that. I hope everybody's all right. It kind of looked like they just ran off the road and just, like, they veered off the road and it should just topple, yeah, like, over. which is what I've been thinking of. It was going to happen with the U-Haul. So, hey, but, um, okay, well, if you got air in your tire, that's cool. Um, don't make the payment and make sure you call them. I mean, the idea of the phone call is so that you don't have to go down there, you feel me? But chances are you're going to have to go down there. You feel me? You feel me? Unless, I mean, go ahead. Okay, yeah, but did she tell you when? Okay, so... So are you telling me that's what you want me to go off of? Is that, you, is that why you're telling me that right now? Is that what you want me to go off of? Or are you just giving me some information or something? Huh? You know what? I asked you two questions. Or are you just giving me some information? So if you're talking too fast, you cut me off, bitch, and then you let me finish. So that's your two questions. Is that what you want me to go off of? Like, is that what you want me to take and say, okay, we're going to go with that? You feel me? Or are you just giving me the information? Because you know I need the information. So, Dan, that's upsetting for you? Dan, I'm saying that's upsetting for you that you're giving me the, the information? Okay, we'll find a place. All the people and handle the business, okay? Handle the business. Like, I know you can do it. All right, so call me back. All right. Yeah, this is the bullshit that we... Happy we missed. All the best in every dollar, nigga. All the best in every dollar. Well, that's something, in it? Can y'all see that? I don't know if y'all can see that, man. I see a lot of money bands and shit. You gotta ask yourself, man, how a motherfucker go from all right, it's a fucked up. Fucked up. Like, all the way fucked up. Like, not like cool, like, you feel me? Yeah, but like, niggas, like, how nigga do that? Yeah, how nigga do that, man? You gotta know it. Yeah, I wish I could answer the question. No, maybe you ain't thought about the answer. I really haven't. Yeah, I bet if you suddenly thought about the answer, you'd come up with it. James Wood. Auto part, that's my uncle. Man. Oh, we got caught. Give me a Cadillac, huh? We own cars. We got Cadillacs, Pontiacs, Buick, GMC, trucks. This shit right here, bro, calls for another stogie. Hey, man, I'm going to encourage y'all, man, right now, right here, right now, I'm going to encourage you to... Start putting out your blunt. This is a little too small for real, but it's still better than nothing though. Start putting out the blunt because it's a man. Oh no, we ain't gonna light this up. We gonna roll the other blunt, right? Oh yeah. Man, when you put out the blunt, man, and then bring it back, man. When you forgot about, like, say I forgot about it. You feel what I'm saying? And then we just wanted a hit, a little hit. That's all, nigga, needed a little hit. A little kiss with look, the blunt. Look, look, look. Ain't trying to make out with it. Just pucker up, you know. You know what I mean? Kiss it like a long love, rather than the tip. 
put your blunt out, man. It's the best thing you ever do, man. Because when you come back to it, you ain't got to stop and take the time to roll a whole nother blunt, the whole process. And you're driving, you're, you're doing something, you feel me? You're by yourself, so you don't really got all the hands that you need, you feel me? Just put that motherfucker out, man, and get back to it, man, like 30, 45 minutes later, man. Be a, man, a pleasant surprise, I'm trying to tell you. Pleasant surprise, man. So, uh...